Hey guys, happy Friday. I just finished taking a shower and washing my hair and getting dressed because we are going to go out to dinner with our friends. So, um, yeah, I'm going to get ready now. We, um, I'm going to record a little vlog and finish getting ready. Let me show you guys my cute dress my mom got me. Let me see if I could get a good angle. Okay, wait. Let's find some good lighting. Isn't it cute? Let me see. It's adorable. I like it. I forgot where she got it. I think she got it at um. I think she got it at um Sears. And she got me this other really cute um, red dress that I'm going to wear for my birthday next week. And it looks retro. It looks like it's like from the 50s. It's like really tight here. And then in the bottom, it opens up a little bit. And it, it just looks like one of those 1950s dress. And I love it because my mom knows that I, I love retro things. So yeah, that's going to be nice. It's going to be a fun birthday weekend. I'm so nervous because I'm going to have my first cheat day on my birthday. We're going to go out to eat sushi next Friday. So I have to mentally and physically prepare myself for my first ever cheat meal, you guys. And it's not going to happen often. It's going to be a one-time thing for a very long time. I probably won't have another one for like another year. But yeah. My friend Angel, who's been guiding me through keto, believes that that I'm ready for this. And she says she knows I'm strong enough to get right back on it the next day. But it still scares me a little, you know, because I haven't eaten that way. Or any bad carbs since before keto, since before beating my food addiction. So it's gonna, it's gonna be weird, but you know. Angel says I deserve it and that I should definitely enjoy it because I've earned it and because, you know, I've worked so hard and she knows that I'm strong enough to, you know, to just do it one time and the next day get right back on it. So let's hope so. No, I know so, but it's still a little scary. But anyway, let me finish my makeup and I'll see you guys a little later. All done. You like this lip gloss? I thought it was so cute. My friend got me for Christmas a whole bunch of like different lip glosses. Let me show you guys. I put them in here because they came in a box. Look at that. It's like 14, 15 different shades. And I put like a cute pink one because it matches like with the flowers of my dress. So yeah, I thought it was cute. All right, so my camera's not focusing too good, but I wanted to show you, oh, there we go. I want to show you the dress. Look how pretty. I love it. I can't wait till you guys see the red one that I'm going to wear for my birthday. It's so pretty. I just dropped off the boys at my parents house cuz that's their little routine every Friday night they sleep over well the two oldest ones the Samuel the 13 year old and Jacob the five-year-old cuz my mom can't handle all three of them the baby is um, the baby's two, Caleb but um, sometimes he wakes up in the middle of the night like for a bottle and stuff still so my mom can handle that like she says it's too much for her so when he's a little older I guess he'll get to sleep over you know <laughs> but anyway we're gonna take him with us to Denny's so my friends are gonna pick us up like around 8 which should be in about an hour now so I'm heading back home now and I'm already ready. I left David taking a shower and getting ready. So as soon as our friends come pick us up, we are leaving. I cannot wait, you guys. Go ahead. Um, 
it was this guy trying to cross the street and he got lucky that I saw him because the light is green and he was jaywalking <laughs> why do people do that seriously anyway <laughs> um, so yeah we're gonna go eat at Denny's so when my when my friends get there to pick us up we are gonna leave I'm so hungry I can't wait I've been fasting all day and I haven't felt uh, much hunger today but now since it's approaching actually it's past my dinner time because I'm used to having dinner usually like around 6 7 p.m. so yeah today um, tonight I'm gonna eat a little later than usual because <laughs> by the time my friends get there around 8 by the time we drive to Denny's get there get a table and they so serve us our food it's probably gonna be like eight something almost nine so tonight I'm gonna eat a little later than usual but it's okay it's still within my one meal of day and I always keep it keto when we go out to eat especially at Denny's at Denny's I love it I love their car oh my arm hurts <laughs> I love their coffee and I love um, they, they have so many keto friendly foods I always get breakfast food because I love eggs and stuff like that so I'm probably gonna get I don't think I'm gonna get an omelet this time because I always get that so I think I'm gonna get like a one of those American breakfast slams something that brings like um, scrambled eggs with bacon and sausage I think they do provide the option of turkey bacon so I might do turkey bacon and then probably like a little side of of ranch dressing for my eggs Sometimes I, I love sour cream. Usually I put sour cream on my eggs, but one of the times that we went, my friend was like, oh, I love ranch on my eggs. And I was like, really? Ooh, that sounds good. I've never tried that before. Cause usually I do sour cream on my eggs, but not ranch. <laughs> so I tried it one time and I loved it. So I drizzle like a little bit. I try not to do too much because uh, ranch it, it is a little higher fat. But ooh, I can't wait. And then next weekend, oh my God, for my birthday, you guys, I'm so nervous. Oh my God, my first cheat meal. And I shouldn't call it a cheat day because it's not gonna be me cheating the entire day. It's just gonna be one meal. But oh my God, I'm so nervous, you guys. Oh my God. But yeah, I am almost home. I'm getting home soon. So I'll see you guys a little later. Guys, I'm going prepared. You guys are going to crack up at this. <laughs> Look what I'm taking with me to Denny's. My sugar-free hazelnut creamer. I always do that because <laughs> that's the only way I have my coffee, my keto coffee. And I'm taking <laughs> one of my Quest cookies. I'm going prepared. <laughs> we are at Denny's already. Yes, yes, I'm so hungry. Yes, yes, are you guys ready to munch? <laughs> are you ready, Buttercup? Yes. <laughs> we're just waiting for our food because we're hungry. <laughs> 60 something dollars. Yummy. I love Denny's coffee. It's so good. Look. Best Buy exclusive Halloween Steelbook, $65. So I got the Grand, no, not the Grand Slam. I got the Build Your Own Slam. I got four scrambled eggs with cheese. I got turkey bacon, oh sausage. Oh, no, and I got my coffee, and she's going to bring me a Caesar salad. Look at that yummy Caesar salad. Of course, I'm not going to eat the croutons. <laughs> And she brought the, the Caesar dressing on the side. And then I got my ranch there. Yeah, I, put a, I drizzled a little bit on my eggs. So, yeah. Okay, so we came to Target because Best Buy is closed. So hopefully they have my Halloween because I just found out that the Halloween Steelbook is only a Best Buy exclusive and they are completely out in all the Best Buys here in Miami. So. I lucked out, but they do still have the Blu-ray, so I'm going to get the Blu-ray. <laughs> I already got my copy. And look what they have. They have Goosebumps, too. I haven't seen it yet. But that's, is that the one that came out in the movie theater recently? <coughs> yes, I got my copy. <laughs> look what I found. An Aretha. 
Aretha Franklin record. The Atlantic Singles Collection, 1967 to 1970. Oh my god, yes! Look at this. It has a lot of my favorite songs. Yep, I'm gonna get it. Look what we found. Sorry, not sorry. I've never heard of it before. Didn't even know this existed. We have sorry. <laughs> I didn't know this one existed. But look how cool what it says. It says sabotage your friends in this race around the board. <laughs> Steal their pawns and use cards to expose their wild have you ever secrets. <laughs> this looks like fun. We're going to get it. Heck yeah. <laughs> the guys are playing football in Target. Can you guys believe that? <laughs> in the middle of Target. <laughs> Can you imagine if a worker comes here and be like, hey, are you guys buying that? <laughs> That's hilarious. Why you get so loud? Don't do it, don't do it. <laughs> Somebody's happy with his goofy. Do you like your goofy? See? Oh, he loves his goofy. So I was looking through the shirts section to see if they had any horror shirts, but they don't have anything horror. So I found Scooby Doo, which I love. The only thing is that like the smallest size they have is large, but I'm still gonna get it because I love Scooby Doo. So I'm probably just gonna use it as a like a sleep shirt but isn't it cute but yeah I'm here in all the shirt sections no! and they don't have any horror shirts nothing at all they have Atari I like Atari but I want something horror themed but nothing it's like Metallica and Let's see what else <laughs> Mountain Dew cruel intentions they don't have any horror shirts but yeah, I'm gonna take that Scooby-Doo one. Hey guys, so we just got home and so I'm gonna show you guys what we got at Target. Whoa. We got this for Caleb and Jacob. <laughs> Mickey Mouse Clubhouse. Mickey and Donald have a farm. Um, David got this Legend of Zelda keychain. And David got Once Upon a Deadpool. They say this one is kid friendly. So let's see. PG-13. Um, woo! We got Venom. We saw this movie already. It's so good, you guys. And oh my god. David and his movie. Seriously. The Happy Time Murders. This is one of David's. <laughs> I got my Halloween, as you guys saw. Blu-ray, DVD, and digital. Let me see what else. David got Happy Gilmore and Billy Madison. And I got, this is for the little girl of the house. <laughs> I love Garfield. I got 20 Garfield stories. This was like only $5.99, so yay, I'm excited. Let me see what else. Oh, well, you guys saw my, my Scooby-Doo shirt. Love you. Babe, hurry up. Don't take long, okay? Go get my uh, Musinex. Um, David's gonna want to see the us because this. I I am so congested that my ears are like getting clogged up. Yeah, I showed that already. Right. So he's gonna go get me some Musinex. So yeah, I got the Scooby Doo shirt. What else? And then David. David got this for our son Sam. He loved that's Zelda, right? Yeah. It came out just like yeah. It says it's dangerous to go alone. Take this. <laughs> it's so cute. Odd. So this is like he's gonna hang it up in his room. And then we got this game that I showed you guys over there at the store. Sorry, not sorry. And last but not least, my Aretha Franklin um, record. So, yeah. Small little mini Target haul. All right, you guys. Well, I'm going to end this video here. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. And as always, stay tuned for more. And I'll see you guys in my next video. All right, guys. Bye-bye.